Hello everybody and welcome back. Welcome back once again to Let's Play The Sims 3. Generations of Pets. It's finally here again. First set of updates was mainly me creating Shay Jones. But now it has been created. It's time for us to start DLP proper. So here we are. Mikey. June. Johnny Five makes a return also, and Little Maya. Uh, before we commence the start of this session, I had a few things to do. I had to tidy up my house a little bit. And uh, I did that. There was a little jutting out wall here, which I had to delete. Uh, there was a curtain upstairs, which I had to add in on this window here. Uh, I've just done a bit of a rejig in this pet's bedroom. And uh, yes, downstairs in the toilet, a few, few people were rather, rather irked with the fact that we have massive windows overlooking the toilet. So what I've done is I've put blinds on them. One there, and one there. So it's a little bit more private for people that want to use the bathroom. Yes, we're not uh, naturists, exhibitionists. So yeah, a little bit of privacy is fine. We've left this window open though, unless somebody actually wants to physically come into our garden and peer in, nosy parkers, then we should be fine there. So we've altered that. We've also, uh, on the, I can't remember who it was, somebody suggested that it might be a good idea to put a half wall on your kitchen. And I thought, you mean, heck, you might be right there. So I put a half wall on the kitchen. So there we go. So whoever that was, you know who you are. I thank you for your suggestion. I, I've taken you up on your idea. So we've got a half wall in the kitchen now, and uh, I've also put this statue back to against the wall. It wasn't against the wall because of the... Uh, the blasted burger alarm, which was in the way at the time, but now it's fine. It has to go here now. I wonder if that's close enough to the door. <laughs> Should burglars enter? So yes, that's that. Uh, and apart from that, nothing else has really changed. We've put the car here. Junzu had the big lemon. It's about all we can afford right now. We've bankrupted ourselves in building this place. So I will just uh, take on a guided tour. Obviously, we've seen the the building video, but uh, uh, just to find the intricacies, I suppose. We've got a trampoline. I've never used one of these before. This uh, will be interesting to see. We have a swimming pool, which makes the return. I wonder if we'll actually use it more this time. The hot tub. The old famous hot tub here is making a return. Barbecue. Hopscotch. The age-old childhood game of hopscotch. It's, it's, uh, it was a mystery. A mystery to some people, but to others it was hours of fun. Yes. Sandpit. We have a sandpit also. And moving inside, we have obviously the bathroom, the study, with grand piano. Somebody must learn this. I, I love the sound of a perfectly played grand piano, but for the moment nobody has skill in music, so it will sound like a strangled cat. Uh, anyway, kitchen. We have a turtle terranium making a new um, uh, arrival. Rather than having fish today, not today, this time, uh, we're going to have turtles. Just a little bit of variety. We have a gym equipped with music and equipped also with da -da -da, flat screen TV right in front of the machine so you can watch TV as you work out because we are really that, <laughs> really that bad. And that reminded me, I just wanted uh, decoration. I think this set of updates is mainly going to be a few fine tweaks here and there before the, we really get into the swing of things. I wanted a full length mirror. Yes, I did. Right next to the music, so that when we're working out, we can look at ourselves, because we're really that vain. <laughs> Alright, so there you go, there's a full-length mirror in the gym. Okay, and that's downstairs, pretty much started, with new spiral staircase. Okay, I've noticed something else I'm not quite happy with, just bear with me, this is going to take a... I wonder if we could actually change the colour. Yes, we can change the colour, because it's a little bit too light. I like the dark brown look, so we'll uh, put that on here. That's it. Then I'm going to move it down. Alright, good. Okay. There we go. Excellent. So there we have the spiral staircase uh, going upstairs. 
which is just the bedrooms, really. We have Maya's massive bedroom. It's bigger than any room in the house. Because she is, well, she's Mikey's little girl, and he, what the hell's this? This is a gap in the carpet. <laughs> Why do you never notice these things when you're blooming doing it in the first place? Ah, uh, e I, 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 how do we... I don't know. Why is it done this? There's gotta be an easy way to do this. Eye dropper. There you go. Okay. <laughs> there we go. Because yes, because Mikey said yes. My little girl will have the biggest room, the most toys, uh, have the most fun. That's what he said. We have their bedroom. Juno, Mikey's. It's rather empty. No, you just need to sleep here. You don't need to have fancy trinkets in here, do you? Uh, so we have uh, his, his diploma, a, a picture, a wardrobe, and some kind of funky mirror. And that's about it, really. Nothing else required. we got Johnny Fire's bedroom over here. Even more even more empty, really. It uh, consists of a bed and uh, a dresser. And no mirror for Johnny, because he doesn't need to improve his looks. Then we have the pet's bedroom. Equipped with one house, and we're getting two pets. I might have to buy another one, but for now we'll leave it. The cat jungle, the cat something or other. Uh, that's about it. Ensuite bathroom. Um, which reminds me, there's no there's no communal bathroom here, is there really? Oh well, people shall have to use that one. Design flaw there. <laughs> Never mind. This one downstairs. Anyway, that's that. So that's the house in all its glorious technicolor. So it's going to be the the, the the first order of the day. It's going to be changing Jamie's look. She Jamie. Oh my God, I'm I'm starting again. <laughs> starting again with misnaming people. It's Jun. Too many J's. Uh, yes, we're going to be uh, changing Jun's look. She needs to sort her hair out. She needs to get some new clothes. These look a bit frumpy. She uh, she aged up at the end of the last LP, so she really needs to uh, to get herself sorted. Uh, Johnny Five is still going to be looking towards, working towards his uh, lifetime wish, which is to master writing and master painting. He, of course, he's mastered writing already, so it's all about mastering that painting. Uh, Mikey has now sort of retired. He left the film industry behind. Um, got a small payout for his efforts. And um, somebody was asking, where's Jamie's guitar now? We had about 150000 when we sold our old apartment and all the belongings, which wasn't enough to buy this house, which cost about 180000 so it was 30000 short, so he got a small payout from his movie career, early retirement, and uh, he also auctioned off uh, Jamie's guitar. Rather unfortunate, but uh, <laughs> he's not really a firm believer of keeping trinkets, so he sold off, auctioned off Jamie's guitar, the famous Jamie Jones of Bright... Uh, of Bridgeport, and uh, got a quite nice sum for it. Somebody was itching to buy it, and uh, that sort of provided the Jones family with the necessary funds to be able to purchase their new abode. So there's no more James Guitar. Uh, he is now unemployed for the moment, and Jun is about to retire from her makeover job. It was only a, a sort of a part-time thing to keep her busy. She no longer needs it, so she's going to retire. So that's about it. So without further ado, we're going to start playing the game. <coughs> Sorry, just bear with me. Now, uh, we've obviously lost all our friends because we've moved towns. And uh, I think one of the early things we're trying to try to do is trying to get Johnny and Maya's relationship up. Uh, Uncle Johnny Five there, having it already cuddling and picking her up naturally without any intervention. So that's a good sign. Take Jamie off, uh, Jun, Jun, I don't get the name right. Take Jun off and uh, get her sorted, changing her appearance. And uh, Mr. Mikey. Now this, I am not giving you any lies here. This is not something I've planned. But when I first uh, finished building the house and looked at the, uh, the the characters for the end of the last set of updates, Mikey had a want. It's no longer here, unfortunately. But he did have a want up here to join the political career track, which I, th <laughs> which I thought at the time hmm, rather bizarre, but then I thought, hmm, he's a five-star celebrity. He's a hard-working five-star celebrity who is ambitious. 
and he's not quite ready to sit around on his laurels and retire. He wants to make his mark upon this new town. So he thought how best to make his mark upon this new town and become even more famous in his own right than to join the political career. So that's what he's going to do very first task of the day. He's going to actually join the political career. Almost like Arnold Schwarzenegger from the movie scene to the political scene. So here we go. Mikey Jones is going to actually become a politician. Have you ever heard anything so ridiculous? I don't know. He might turn out to be pretty good. He's certainly uh, <laughs> extravagant to say the least. So that's going to be his first task. We'll see how it works out. That's what he wanted when he first arrived and he is going to get it. He's going to try his very best to become the almighty political guru of this new town. Okay, so uh, he's left. Johnny Fiver seems to have left Maya on the floor here. I don't really quite attack with the cl the claw. Is this the claw, a la liar, liar? <laughs> it's the claw, Maya. It's coming for you. Oh, we're having some really issues, frame rate issues here. Hey, the claw's coming! The claw is coming! <laughs> Attack with the claws, great. Okay. Toss in there. A bit of tickle, a bit of snuggle bugger. A bit of something else. More claw! You can't ever have too much claw. And um, what else? In fact, Maya's aging up. Uh, yes, she's aging up today. It's her birthday. It's, I, phew, we're going to have to sort that out in a, in a jiffy, aren't we? But for now, the yeah, fine. Fine, fine. Let's go. Attack out with the claw. Ooh, he's got there already. That's pretty swift. So, unfortunately for Mikey, starting a new job, he, he, he's having to start from the bottom of the career ladder, which means longer hours and more days working. Sort of taking a backward step, but it's all a sacrifice that needs to be made for him to achieve his new goal. Oh my god, it's all kicking off here. Arno! Hello! There you go. Hello, John! We need to sort you out. Yeah. Black hair. Same hairstyle. That'll do us. Nothing too fancy. Just give her her hair colour back. Marvellous. Right. Moving swiftly on. It's nine o'clock in the morning. Where's John gone? I'm going to have to bear with me while I get used to the keys again. And I get used to just... Uh... She's going to quit her job as well. Yeah, swiftly. She sort out a few things, just rather, you know, it's not a seamless plan outfit. There you go. 